kills. What's the problem? We've got an emergency on that force. Oi! Just a minute. Oof. Oof. Nearly there. And push. Oh. That's it, oh. One more last effort. That's it. Hot water, Naz. It's my first, you know. Congratulations. Hello, I'm Dillis. Oh, hello, Dillis. My name's Alberta. How are you feeling? Oh, I'm all right. It's my first egg, you know. It can be hard work having a baby. I remember my first. Have you had many children? Quite. 53 at the last count. But, you know, every one of them is very special. And you're going to have some more soon? Oh! oh. Help! Help! Oh. Here they come now. It's a boy. And a girl. And another boy. You see, once you've had a few, there's nothing to it. Oh. Hello. Mm, yum, it's yum. not for you, Dr. Atticus. In fact, don't tell anyone. But it's a secret chocolate Easter egg for Sally. Now, where can I hide it? I know. Happy Easter, Dr. Atticus. Happy Easter, Dr. Matthews. Isn't it a lovely spring morning? Daffodils out, hey, hey, blossom oh, in yes. the breeze, romance in the air. Romance. Yes, hope so. Alberta's so pleased with her first egg. Ever thought it's time to have a family? Wouldn't you like to hear the patter of tiny feet, Dr. Matthews? Wait a minute. Oh, I can hear the patter of tiny oh. feet. You'd make such a good father, Dr. Matthews. <clears throat> you can't have them running around the hospital like that. I'll see they behave. Now, now, where does it hurt? It's my head. I'll kiss it better. That won't work. I wasn't born yesterday. <laughs> no, you were born today. But it, let's put it, a bandage it. on it instead. Oh, gosh, Dr. Atticus, there's an egg in this box. That's right. Dr. Matthews put it there. Uh, oh, dear. I don't think I was meant to say that. Oh, well, never mind. Yes, yes. well, i uh, better go and inspect the new echocardiogram machine. It's just arrived. I'm sure that egg's not for me. There. That's better. Though this one is for Dr. Matthews. Can't you do something with these children, Nurse Bunny? So I'd appreciate it if you could find something to occupy them. Oh, don't worry, Doctor. I've had an idea about that. Jolly good. Now, children, do you know what day it is today? It's Easter. And at Easter, everybody gets a chocolate egg. And you've all got one each. Oh, here's mine. Where's mine? Well, that's a secret. Because while you were running around, I've been hiding them. So now, you've got to go and find them. Oh, oh, oh. oh come on. Well, that should keep them occupied for a while. Dennis? Yes, Alberta? Seeing all your children running about makes me want to stretch my legs myself. I'll leave my egg under the covers. It'll be quite safe there, won't it? Of course it will. This is an echocardiogram machine, Ted. Latest technology. With this probe here, I can put it on any part of your body, say your head, for instance. And then, on this screen, I'll be able to see what's inside your head. It must be a really clever machine if it can find anything inside your head. An Easter egg. Just what I was thinking about. Well, that can't be right. Now, who put that in there? Don't know. What are you going to do with it? Eat it, I suppose. Mmm. Oh! 10, 11, 12, 13. All here. And has everyone found their well, now we're all going to the playroom for the next part of Easter. Rolling our eggs. Come on. Where are you all off to? 
to roll our eggs. What fun! My egg! It's gone! It can't have gone, Alberta. Who would have taken it? But it has gone! My egg! My egg's been abducted! Help! Help! Now don't panic, Alberta. It must be here somewhere. Where did you leave it? I left it in my bed. Did you see anything, Delis? No, it's been quiet in the ward. Only my children looking for their Easter eggs. Looking for eggs? Dillis, where are your children? Oh, they were just off to... <gasps> Roll their eggs! <laughs> OK, everyone ready? When I say roll, we'll race your eggs. One, two, three, and stop! No, no stop. Just hold them still. One of those eggs isn't yours. One of them's Alberta's baby. Is it? But which one? That is what we've got to find out. Careful, Ted. I know oh, I'm God. only an ambulance driver, but I know how not to drop things. Well, ideas, anyone? Um, uh, um, I've got an idea. You've got an idea? But you're just an ambulance driver. Why shouldn't I have an idea? I may not be anything special, but just because... Yes, all right, Ted. What is well, it? Well, a while ago, Dr Matthews here was showing us this machine. And he said, if he put this thing against my head, he could see what was in my head. The new echocardiogram machine? Yes, that's it. Well, if he could use it to see inside my head, couldn't he use it to see inside the eggs? Blimey! But I think there's something inside your head after all. <laughs> Dr Matthews, prepare the echo. Kitty, clean eggs for inspection. Dr Atticus, go and keep hey, those rabbits hey, oh, apart. Yes. We've got work to do. Yep. Yep. Wait a minute. Got it. Are you sure? Absolutely positive. Can we have our eggs back yet? In a minute. But I'm afraid one of you won't get one. There are only 12. Wait a minute. I've got an egg they can have. I'll get it. That's very kind of you, Kitty. But don't worry. It don't matter if one of them don't get an egg. It does matter. You see, every one of these children is special. They're kind of her. But I wonder, whatever did happen to that 13th egg? <laughs> Oh, excuse me. <laughs> oh, <laughs> isn't she lovely? <laughs> oh, she's very shy. Doesn't it make you see how special everyone is, Sally? I know how special they are, Dr Matthews. That's why I devote my life to making them better. Doesn't it make you want to have babies, Sally? Not at this precise moment. I've got a very tricky operation to perform to remove an ingrowing horn from Renny Rhino. Oh, hello, Dr. Matthews. Hello, Kitty. You all right? Oh, I was just thinking how it would be nice having a family one day, seeing all those babies. Well, cheer up, Kitty. Look, I know. I've got you a little present. But surely this isn't for me. Isn't it for someone special? Everyone's special, Kitty. Happy Easter, Dr. Matthews.